Well, hello, everybody, and welcome to what is the opening day of the 16th European Championships. 55 UEFA member states tried their hand at becoming the finest of them all. Now we are left with the 24 who have made it to these finals. Opening day certainly has a special feel to it. The atmosphere, combustible but joyous, as we usher in a new era for this competition, together with the hopes and aspirations of all that take part. Worth reminding ourselves too that 2020 is the 60th birthday of these championships and it is for that special reason that the competition is being held right across the continent. No question that this is one of the great capital venues of the Netherlands, the Johan Cruyff Arena, Amsterdam. Here it is then, the first page of the first chapter of this special tournament. All I hope is that these nations, as well as the players of course, can make a good account of themselves. And I also like the fact that such excitement isn't just something that one host country has the monopoly of. It's shared by so many people across the continent, literally, and that certainly created a, an extra special buzz. the whistle who do you Jim see making a difference here Gareth Bale for me has got to be the, the standout man uh, renowned for his great pace he also has a oh, that's a foul free kicks been given Poulsen can't get the better of his opposite number Bale over to the left couldn't turn it in. Now that was a slick move and there were several options in the box to, uh, to pick out. Kia. Jack goes looking. And it's played forward. Pass. Nice. That's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. He's not going to get that. Delaney. Allen with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. to get it wide now Jim yeah I think they've decided to concentrate on, on working the flanks to help the production line it's uh, it's where the room is and it's Vass more than happy to take the muscular approach he is not one readily to admit defeat don't be surprised if he tries that again and they've been caught out here Gets away from his opponents, going for goal! Goal, Wales! And it's Wales who take the lead! Oh, 
high quality goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second. A 1-0 lead established. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Hoiberg switches it towards the other side. Plays it out to the wing. Swung over. And that has gone horribly wrong. Davis. Ampadu battles to win it back. A real chance to break. Gets the better of his man. It has and the finish. Well, he should have done better, and he knows it. Uh, that's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. Delaney. Hardly anything between the sides, and it's 1 0. Forward it goes. Tries a shot! Oh, that's a fine save! Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Played it short. Hoiberg. And here's Ericsson. Cut out in the nick of time. Bale has created one goal already. And here's Ramsey. Receives it in a good position. Plays it back. Brought forward, what does he try from here? Gets wrestled off the ball. Ericsson. And it's Vass. Ericsson. Just brushed off the ball there. Goes for goal! Oh, what a wonderful stop! Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. And that has been cleared. Three brings the first half to a close. And there we are, off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front end for the half time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. Wales are going to have the lead in a tight old game. Half time, 1 0. They're probably into the second 45 minutes. A solitary goal. That has been the crucial difference. Allen. Plays it out to the flank. Poulsen. It could be in here. A 
Aimed in towards the centre. Ampadu. Allen. Allen. And helps available out wide. Oh, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Eriksen demonstrating fabulous determination. He just will not be beaten. Good challenge. He just stood firm. That's a real chance! Really outwitted one on one. Once more, he gets the better of the keeper. Yeah, that's brilliant from him. Such a, a calm finish. Just pick your spot, don't think about what the keeper's going to do, concentrate on what you have to do. Wales grab a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. We're looking at a very different game now, the command has been established. And that's clear cut, it's a free kick. Allen. Out to the right, Bale gets into some space. Hit into the middle, and he's certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. Well, the ref's been lenient here, I doubt he'll get too many more chances. Bale stands over the ball, he'll be looking to dink one in. So who is the target now? He's having a look at what's available. Denied by a great piece of goalkeeping. Well, I thought a starting position was good, and that helped the keeper to judge the flight of the ball and, and deal with it well. Hoiberg plays it forward. Out to the left it goes. needed a better contact. Well, if you're giving something to attack in the air, he's most likely to, to get there. It's what he does best. So here comes a substitution. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Played out to the right, Allen. This defence is, is weary about opposition pace. So they're just not getting too tight. Yeah, they know that if they... they... Has a pop! And more, and more! And the lead is extended still further. That was easy, almost too easy. Well, it's pretty damning on the part of that defence, Peter, that he was allowed so much time and space. But I think you have to give credit where it's due. And it was a brilliant set-up and finish.
Denmark making another change here. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. And he has been fouled there. Uh, needed a better pass there. Vass gets rid without sophistication. Final five minutes. Poulsen. Davis drives it forward. Ball through needs to be good here. Oh, he's been flattened there. Four added minutes on the board. On the right now, what's on? The referee's awarded a free kick. Has a goal! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Final act. Wales start as they wanted to start. All three points, the first three points, crucial. Would you summarise what we've seen today, then, Jim? Listen, ideally, any new campaign.